today I'm going to give you two tips on how to get the most out of your iPad or iPhone. Today we're looking at my iPad, but it'll work exactly the same on any iPad or iPhone. The first tip I like to give when using an iPhone or an iPad is to make sure that you're not running excess programs in the background. Apple allows you to switch quickly between open iPad apps, but a lot of times you don't realize that some apps are still open on your iPad. To see what apps you are running, just simply double click with your finger on the home button here. That will open up a list underneath the screen of what is currently running. And you can scroll through this side to side just to see which apps are running. And you can quickly tap and get between the open apps by double clicking again on the little home button here and then tapping on another app. If you want to close some of the apps that you're running, again double click to pull up your list of apps and then press and hold on any of your apps and you're going to get this little red circle with a line in it and then you can just simply tap on the ones that you want to close then push your home button one time to stop them from jiggling and one time again to get back to your home screen then the second little tip is as you start adding apps sometimes it's not so easy to go through and and see all of the different apps that you have on your screen and quickly identify the ones that you want to get to so a faster way to navigate your iPad and get to the apps that you want quickly is again to use the home button and if you push it once it'll bring you back to the home screen and if you push it again it brings you to the search the iPad screen or the find screen so if I want to quickly get to my YouTube app I can just start typing in the search box and it'll quickly bring up the YouTube app. So I can just tap it and I'm transferred to the YouTube app.